I think a few things that we, we strive for each patient's experience is to make sure that we communicate well. That's always important. We try to set the realistic expectations. It is oral surgery, so we try to dispel any myths. We try to really explain what we can offer and really explain what they might expect during a recovery period or during the surgery itself. And hopefully, when we first meet them, they can walk away with a level of confidence that when they return for the surgical procedure, they're going to be just fine. Our office is definitely very welcoming. We have a comfortable setting and definitely feel at home while you're here. The staff relates to the patients. They are their advocates for the home care instructions, what to expect after surgery, what they're going into. The staff, they are very bubbly people who are welcoming and they like to make conversation with you. When you walk in, they just welcome you with a kind heart. For me, surgery is a little bit like a dance. There are many steps and we're very particular about each step. I'm somewhat of a perfectionist and that I found helps provide better results for our patients when you approach surgery in that way. Dr. Ozens is an absolutely wonderful surgeon. He is very upbeat, motivated, loves to joke, and he definitely makes our patients feel very comfortable. Yeah, I've been seeing Dr. Ozens for years now, and from the very beginning, he's just so, uh, such a friendly guy. He just puts you at ease right away. Now that I've seen him for so long, now it's just like kind of seeing an old friend. I, I come in, I'm just, so relaxed and comfortable, I, I'm not even thinking about the procedure, you know, what's going to happen. He's very good at explaining exactly what he's going to be doing. So the technology we use in our office allows us to see better anatomy, better structures of the jaws or teeth, and so we can provide more precise surgeries given the type of imaging that we have available. If we were not able to manage and control pain or discomfort either during surgery or after surgery, I probably wouldn't be an oral surgeon. Quite frankly, I oftentimes tell my patients, look, if we need to use a sedation, it's because I want you to be comfortable and I wanna make sure you and I are still friends afterwards. So that is important to me. So anesthesia, pain control, keeping patients comfortable is very important to me which is another reason why I love the field, because advances either in pharmacology or anesthesia have come to the point where we can do many different types of procedures and the patients essentially go home as if nothing happened.